I'm tying on an owner Super Yamame size seven eyeless hook, and since it's eyeless, we need to add an eye. You can use a lot of different materials for the eye. Usually I use silk bead cord, but in this case, I'm gonna be using 20 pound amnesia to make a loop, just because it's a little bit more durable, and since it's rigid, it keeps the eye open, uh, unlike silk bead cord, which can kind of collapse on itself. And this just makes it easier to thread when you go to tie the fly on. So I'm using 20 pound red amnesia. That also gives it kind of a hot spot. And I just, I'm gonna tie this down a little bit down the body to build up a little bit of bulk, but also to give it strength so it doesn't pull out when there's a fish on. And clip the end. So the loop looks like that. Now I'm gonna smooth out the body where the butt ends of the amnesia are. That just makes a little bit more of a tapered underbody for the dubbing to go on. And start to dub the body. I'm using a burnt orange color here just because I think it'll complement the ginger hackle I'm gonna use for this fly. But of course you can use any color you want. and stop at about a third of the hook shank length. Tie in the hackle. This is essentially a dry fly hackle, the same size as the hook. And I'm gonna tie it with the curvature facing toward me, like I would a dry fly, because I want the fibers to point forward. This is a stiff hackle after all. And just add a little bit more dubbing for the thorax. and make a few wraps of the hackle. And tie off. Pull the hackle back a little bit and wrap a nice little head. and whip finish. And that's it.